to the Northampton Commission on Disabilities. This meeting is being recorded and videotaped. Um, so first we'll do introductions. Um, just go around the room and say who we are. Thank you for There you go. Okay, so perfect. Should I say that again? Okay, so we'll do introductions. We'll just go around the room and introduce ourselves. Um, since I'm speaking, I guess I'll start. I'm Tori Eklund, and I'm the chair of the committee. Hey, Fortin member. I'm Mike Nagy. Jim Winston, member. City Councilor Marianne Barge. Pat Shaughnessy, ADA coordinator. Um, the next agenda item is public comment. I don't believe we have any members of the public here. No, we don't. Okay. Um, Approval of the April uh, 15th, 2014 minutes. Um, I have some corrections. Yeah, I do too. Okay. Um, do you want me to do mine and then? Okay. Um, so the first thing is that um, Hannah Coyle should be added as the vice chair. She should be one. Added as the vice chair, where it says it says chair Ms. Tori Eklund, and then it should say. Hannah's name. Right. But she should she, be under. She wasn't the chair when, when the vice chair when no. we started the meeting. Oh, exactly. right. okay. Okay. So that'll just be added on the next one. But yeah. she is listed within the minutes that okay. she was. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Um, then just a couple of little grammatical things. I'm sorry. I'm just a really picky grammar person. Um, there's one item where it says um, Council of Barge provided members on an update um, of the funds. It should be with an update. It's near the bottom. Yeah, uh, I see it. Okay. Um, and then the Pulaski Park Park dates scheduled. It says at, um, and it should be R. The dates are. <coughs> see that? Yes. Okay. And then one more where it says in front of birds, in front is written as all one word and it should be I N space F R O N T. Um, and that's all I have. I believe Michael, you have some in front of birds. Um, okay. On site is in front of the diner and one in front of birds on the street. Right. And in front is just it should be two words. Now, question. Tori, you got these minutes before this meeting, correct? Yes. Could you please, if you have any corrections, it would be very helpful for Patty to have the minutes completely done so that we do not have to redo these minutes. Or the minutes. Yeah, that was the intention. But they were, um, we got them late this time. We only got them like, I only got them like yesterday. Oh, okay. So, and it was said in Patty's email that we should bring our corrections today instead of doing that. But in right. general, yes. Right. It, it, and that it was, um, I did not get them done. You know, I'm not usually the person doing the minutes, so this was not done in a kindly fashion. Oh, and that reminds me, um, would someone be willing to do minutes for today since Ruth isn't here? Well, I've already started, so. But I, I think in the future that um, I'm sorry. a member of the committee should be doing the minutes. I agree. Well, does anyone want to take that over today? I apologize. Also, keep in mind that we do have the video. The video also is used as a. I'm sorry, go ahead. Is also used as a backup. Absolutely. Okay. And I would suggest because we have Hannah, who's the vice chair, should be taking over the minutes when we don't have Ruth here. Okay. That makes sense. Um, Michael, did you say that you had some corrections well, also? Uh, well, I don't know if it's a correction. It is an oversight. Mm -hmm. It does read, um, um, attend important hearings related to the disabled. Just my kind of correction. Related to people with disabilities rather than to the disabled. Good job. 
Okay, if that was what was said, but I when I wrote with the notes, that's what it was. That's what how it was said. So if somebody said related to the disabled, even though it's persons with disabilities, or well, no, no. I mean, if it, if you are quoting somebody, please put quotations. Okay, I'm just I just wrote down the ideas that came out of the group. I'm, I, I they were not quotations of people. Well, fine, but they were I'm, ideas. Well, I'm just suggesting then that in terms of us writing our minutes, it should be people with disabilities rather than the disabled. Okay, so everybody on the committee should know that's how what is people are addressed. Understand what Michael was saying. He's well, saying no, it was just saying. the way she's you know related to. Um, the disabled. I'm just saying that. Where is that? It's on page two, the second paragraph. Yeah, second paragraph, third line down. So I'm just saying it should be related to people with disabilities rather than the disabled. And I think if we're going to do stuff, it should be grammatically correct for us. Right, and it's also a statement about how we view ourselves, that we don't view ourselves as the disabled, that that's not the whole, the sum total of how we view ourselves, that we view ourselves as people who have disabilities. And right. it's, so it's also, it's, it's also a statement about how we view ourselves and how we want and expect and deserve to be viewed. So it seems like a small thing, but maybe we could say that in the future that we'll be more mindful of using that language. Yeah. Where is that paragraph? Right here. So where you see where you see D, <coughs> excuse me, DA's office, DA's office attend our meetings. Is, right, but what is Bill Northampton as a Sussex City? What does that mean, Bill? Well, that was from Mike Nagy. That's what he said, Bill Northampton as an accessible oh, city. To mark it oh, as. Oh, yeah, mark it as. But that was the word used. Okay. Excuse me, yeah, I mean, just that. And I've our, never seen it like that. Well, no, our website builds us as. Yeah, proclaims us. Maybe that's the word. Proclaims us as an accessible right. city. Right. Instead of, yeah. Okay. 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 There you go. Thank you. Okay. Um, do we have um, a motion to approve the minutes? Motion to approve. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Thank you. Um, the next agenda item is um, purchase of the COD banner. Yes, so um, the banner that you all voted on, <clears throat> we um, actually got it, and Marianne will be very impressed because it actually turned out to be a different color than what we were originally told they could do at Paradise Copies. What color is that? Oh, you have it? Just like ours. Did they do it at Paradise? They do. So Paradise Copies made this. And um, we still have to get the poll for it, so if it is carried, but it will be on the um, table for the health and safety fair. Right. How come they decided to do it blue when they told you they didn't have blue? Because it was a different um, staff person who uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, said, yeah, they do keep things on file mm -hmm. and that they could do it in See. another color. Isn't so, that beautiful? Yeah, it's very nice. Oh, that's great. So, Mary, Councilor Barge had said that the city councilors had a banner, and this pretty much is similar, or mm. the same as mm. the color and the, the printing. Yeah. And we do have a parade coming up. Memorial Day. Yes. So here it is. Right. And, I mean, I have three girls from JFK who will be holding our sign. They've been holding it now three parades that we've attended mm -hmm. from JFK school. They have done <coughs> so well. They're awesome. They dress up according to like the St. Pat's Association and stuff. They're, they're just really great. So I would highly recommend for the Commission on Disability to really look at attending these parades. Michael, you'd be able to? Well, yeah, and kind of 
depends on when it is and whether I can get there. Yep, this one's in Florence. Mm -hmm. And that's your Memorial Day parade. Is it on the Monday? Yeah, May 29th, I think. May 26th. Yeah, May 26th, but I have one on the 25th also up in Leeds. But May 26th is the big one. And it's at Trinity Row, where Trinity Row Fountain is, across from Rogers Bike Shop. That's where we meet at 9.30, and the parade starts right at 10 o'clock. And we walk up, go around by the BFW, go all the way down the street, come up. What's the name of that street? Petty by the fire station. What's that street? Maple. Yeah, then we come up Maple Street, and then we go into the cemetery across from the BFW, and that's where the ceremony is held. Mm -hmm. Well, it's too early for me, and I'm not going to be able to make it. So I'm just letting you know, this is one of the reasons why we purchased this banner, is so that you can participate, show visibility. And, it, you know, sometimes, like Tori, you might be able to get a, somebody from, say, Passage to come and be glad and be honored to hold the banner. Mm -hmm. Same with you, Michael. You might know yep. somebody. Yeah. Yep. So plan on this, starting to organize and plan on it. There is a parade in November for Veterans Day. Yep. Okay. Okay. And then there's the one the day after Thanksgiving. The Veterans Day and Memorial are the same. Reverend, but those are gonna be the big ones. What's the, the one after? Saint Pat's the biggest. Oh, the um, holiday one in Florence? Oh, yeah. that's Christmas. Yeah, that's the one, it's usually the, the Saturday after Thanksgiving. Okay. Yes. All right, so that's a good idea. So it's something for the commission to start looking at, start planning on, and getting organized for that, November. That's it's sounds... colder, but that goes with it. Um, that's great, and I, I think there is more transportation availability in November, like in the for those who rely on public transportation. Um, they're starting to be on summer schedules and stuff, so November would be great. I would love to do that. Yeah. Okay. You've got your husband too, Tori, where he can walk with you. Possibly, or someone mm -hmm. else. I, I depends on his schedule and you know, but yeah. we'll, we could definitely work yeah. something out. Okay. It's um, a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, I can see that it would be. Um, all right. The next item is um, June 16th at 5 o'clock, a meeting for the COD to attend um, the meeting of Social Services, Veterans, Recreation, and Cultural Committee. Right. So that committee invited COD to be on their agenda um, June 16th at 5 o'clock. So hopefully members can come and there's an agenda. Um, yep. That Did everybody get that agenda for that meeting? June 15th? Yes. I'm, I'm planning to come. Okay. June, June 16th. Yeah, I am planning to No, I'm coming. Um, hold on. Let's look at the calendar here. I don't have it with me. It's June but 16th. It's, uh, it's June 16th. It's a Monday. Oh, you know, I have to say this is wrong on here. It's the Monday before our next meeting. Yeah, that's right. Exactly. So we have our meeting on Tuesday, but this meeting is on Monday. And I would Where really is it? look at this carefully. City Council Chambers. Right. The Maybe agenda it's agenda something. City Council Chambers. It's not in City Hall. That's right, right in the chamber Chambers. Chambers. Yeah. yeah, that's we, we've attended a few other times um, as well. I think you were there, Mike. And I know with part, I don't have the agenda with me. Um, I have it in my. But I know room. you were talking. This has not even been posted yet. Okay, okay, so we shouldn't be talking about that. It's not up on the website. Okay. 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 So if people want to see that, it will be posted okay. for the month of June. Okay. okay. Great. So um, what I'm requesting is that the Commission on Disabilities attend this meeting. There will be three of us counselors, Alyssa Klein from Ward 7 and Gina Luis Guerra from Ward 4. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I know some of the things that we talked about and emailed about what we would like to talk at the Committee on Disabilities. Patty 
I think Tori, you worked with her. I sent a couple of things. Michael, I'm yep, sure I sent some things. Mm -hmm. Did Michael send some over? No, I just got stuff from Tori. Mm -hmm. No, I didn't. Okay, because I'm going to be giving you almost 55 minutes to speak. Oh, that's great. Okay, because I have another agency coming in after that right at 5 o'clock, which is the mm -hmm. Recreation Department, and that's very large. So we're coming, we're speaking at 5? Yes. Okay, great. Okay. And I'm hoping that, which I did not see on the agenda, is that the Commission on Disabilities be in full support of implementing a bench being bought by the Commission on Disabilities to be placed in Florence. We can add that to the agenda. I don't think that was on there. It wasn't. That could be added. I don't, I don't think it's been discussed at this meeting, so we can add that. Yeah. It needs to be added. We can put it under other today. Do you want to put it on other today? Yeah. Sure. Uh, put it on the agenda today to talk about the bench and Put it on um, the agenda for coming into social services and veterans affairs. Well, yeah, we can talk about it here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Because we did talk about it here, Michael. I believe we have talked about it. Yes, here. we have. Oh, okay, good. You weren't here. So I think it would be good to put on the agenda for the meeting on the 16th. Okay, I added that. Okay. Had, maybe. Somehow, if we could talk with Richard Parcelletti on the price of what the benches cost, I can't remember. Yeah. Aren't they up there like twelve hundred? Um, I just pulled out a catalog because um, there's going to be a bench put out in the back here. They, the ones that we ordered over here, they were um, like six hundred and something. And then if you got the plate on it, that is like dedication, like I a. It was more than that. In, the, in that plate, yeah. No, I'm not. I'm not sure. So I mean, I can look it up. And I'm sure from whenever we all ordered benches a few years ago that the price is obviously gone up. Yeah, I, I don't know. But I do know in transportation and parking, um, Councilor Alyssa Klein is on it, and she is going to be bringing it up for the month of June okay. to that committee in regards of the procedures of having a bench placed in Florence. And Patty and I, I just spoke with Patty before the meeting of going on site with her and Councilor Alyssa Klein to look at areas up in Florence. And if anybody can think of any ideas in Florence where you think a bench would be great, that would be helpful for us. Okay. And then I'll be making an appointment with Councilor David Murphy because he's a Councilor of Ward 5. So we'll have him come on site with me and Patty and also get a feeling from him where he feels the bench should go. That sounds very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, the next agenda item, HP Spaces in Florence. Do you want to take that, Marianne? Um, so I, we reported already <clears throat> that we went, were up in Florence with um, Alex from the DPW for a space in front of birds and a place of, in front of the diner. Apparently the one in the diner is already on in an ordinance, so that was a nice find. Um, so they're waiting to put a sign up. Um, and then in front of birds, there were three ordinances that um, were at ordinance, went to city council, and they did the first reading. Uh, oh, no, I had to go to transportation. That was a recommendation to send it to Ordinance Committee. Mm -hmm. Then at Ordinance Committee, but, um, Ryan O'Donnell had mentioned how it did not go to transportation, so it was sent back to City Council last week. We referred it to transportation and parking. So then it will come out of transportation, go to City Council. So anyways, we had talked about that the Commission on Disabilities should be attending that and getting up on that microphone and talking about uh, having them approve that recommendation of that handicapped accessible parking place. And you've got the date on that, Patty. Yeah, I'm also waiting to hear back from one of the city councilors to make sure those dates that I had written down were um, correct. 
Can I ask you a question? Sure. I don't know if y'all want to know the answer, but is there a requirement for X number of public parking spaces that there be a disability space included in how many? I mean, it, I mean how many parking space, how many handicapped spaces have to be devoted to a certain uh, area? Well, how many, if I have X number of public parking spaces, how many do I need before I also have to get a disability space? Well, I, I don't know if that, I don't know the answer to that off the end, Michael. Okay. You can get that answer right from Ned Huntley from the Board of Public Works. Yeah, yeah it's, it would also be um, in the ADA regulations. I mean, I could look that up for you, Michael. Sure, yeah, I mean, I'm sure what I, I haven't gone to the trouble of looking it up, I thought maybe I could. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe someone would know. Yeah, so. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's, okay. Um, moving on. Um, the next agenda item is to continue our discussion that we began last month on the future plans of the COD, including plans to meet with other disability committees. Mm -hmm. um, so we were thinking about inviting perhaps the chairs or some of the members of other committees to our June meeting. Any thoughts about that? I, I think in our minutes it said that we were going to try to have Carol Rasek from the um, commission. I think we were having, it said that we were having her in July. We were going to try to have her Correct, say July and then September. Okay, we had some idea for September. A, a, pick, a cook, off, cook out or something. Oh, yeah, that's, no, we're not doing a cook out. I thought we were holding yeah. off. Or do you have in September? Doing something in September. Yeah, that's what I meant. It's a cook out. It says well, kickoff or something. Right, we're doing yeah. some, some so, type of something in September. Yeah. Okay. So you're talking, Corey, about, Tori, about June. I was talking about June, and we had mentioned as a, an idea that it would be great to um, affiliate with some of the right. other disability committees. How about Starbucks? Right. Inviting them? We could invite them, or I was thinking also if um, like Amherst or Hadley or other towns or East Hampton had committees on disabilities that we might want to. Doesn't Stavros also? Stavros is an independent living center. They they're right. they don't they're have excellent. Access. They're awesome. They should yeah. come here also. But they're not. They're not. A, they're not, they're not a commission. They participate. But they could participate. Well, There's no reasons why they can. Stavros would be great to have just as the just one, as the, exactly. just to have as the one um, sort of guest speaker, mm -hmm. and then um, an, another meeting to have um, various members yes. from the um, committees on disabilities, commission on disabilities. How about Do they have a commission yeah. on disabilities? We yeah. probably okay. should invite. I think I was thinking East Hampton, Hadley, and Amherst were my thoughts. Yeah. And what month is that in June? We had discussed doing it in June if people are agreeable to that. Well, it sounds fine, except that June is kind of a upon us. That's what? Upon us. I mean, I don't know whether it would be easier to just say, why don't we do that in August or something like that. Maybe and we could have Stavros come next month. If they, yeah, I think they would be easier to schedule. I, 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 I agree with you, Michael. I mean, I... Well, yeah, maybe we could have yeah, right. So have us in June, then Carol in July, and maybe have the um, other committees in August. That might be a bad problem because of vacations too. True. Well, then we could wait. Maybe we can, you know, we'll just buy them. Have the cookout and invite them all. That's what I was just gonna say. She did. We're thinking, thinking the same. I was thinking maybe that would be a nice way to introduce them and have we right. could we could have part of the time where we talked about business and then we could have sort of a social and get to know them. Maybe we could invite them to um, a social and we can social. say on an invitation, you are invited to a social given by the Commission on Disabilities in Northampton. And we can say we're having a cookout. We can set up a nice invitation. So, yes. Right. So are we talking in September? September. September. Mm -hmm. And that will also be our And welcome. another good idea, because we have a parade in November for veterans, you could bring that up. 
with the committee here and get the, getting them together to march also. That would be awesome. Yeah. Sure would. That would be great. So I think that's Working sounds, together, that's what we'll call it. That sounds <laughs> That's a good slogan. <laughs> Love it. So um, who do we want from Stavros to come? I mean, I know a few people there, but do people have thoughts about that? My thought was um, the person I know that runs the independent living is Janet Shaw. And I really like her. Do you know her? Yeah, and yes. Shaw's I mean, I, I don't know whether they, if you were to just. Is she the director there? She's the director. I think she's the director of the independent living program. Uh-huh. Right? I think she's a. I think that's right. She's a big title. That sounds fun. Yeah. Um, Patty, if you want me to take one thing off your plate, I don't mind calling her because I know her. Um, actually, okay, that's unless you want to do it. No, I, I think that the more the committee members can get involved with doing things that are pertinent to the committee, okay. that it's you know this is your committee, it's not my committee. I'll invite her. So I'll invite her and to ask her to say that we want her to speak for what about thirty minutes? Yep. Okay. Okay. So can we just back up here so I can have June Stavros would be here and you're going to contact. Um, I will she contact okay. Janet. And then. Um, in September, inviting East Hampton have the Amherst uh, to a social mm -hmm. cookout type thing. Um, and then November, trying to get them to um, participate in working together. In September, you're saying East Hampton, Hadley, and what else? Hadley. And Hadley. Okay, and then what if, uh, in July it would be Carol. Yes. And Carol actually will be here um, at our health and safety fair. And um, Stavros is also at our health and safety oh, fair. They each have a table. Good. Oh, excellent. Um, yeah. All right. I so. think when we're looking at Stavros coming in June, we can ask them that we really want to make a bridge with them. It's time to do this. We need to start a bridge. Yeah. Because we've not had a connection doing a bridge, which is excellent. Yeah. Important matters that are coming up. Yep. We get this bridge together, East Stanton, Amherst, and Hadley, and combine. Well, Stavros is excellent, and I know that they're right on top of important issues and mm -hmm. are oh, awesome. They, they are awesome, and um, Janet particularly is awesome, so I will be happy to do that. That'd be super. Thank you. No problem. Okay, so um, under, do we need to vote on these plans, or is this, no. is this these are just, Okay, decisions they were making. Okay, so I know that under other, um, Patty and I had put um, one item, which was to see if there would be anyone available to um, sit at the table for the health and safety fair on May 22nd. Um, it's at the senior center, right? No, but where is this on the agenda? On other. Oh, we put it under other. We put it on other? Yeah. You're talking about the um, health fair this week, mm -hmm. yeah. and it was asked on the website, Patty, for the commission to volunteer to do this. You reached out to people, right? To, to our ask for volunteers. Yeah, I did, yes. And you got no response. Um, well, Ruth is doing it. Ruth is here um, doing um, a volunteer job, but she said before or after she could do the um, table for parts. Yes, and tell me she was doing brisk, what is that? The, in the bistro, yeah, she's working in Right, the, yeah. Yeah, I'd be willing to do it at that, at that, towards the end. Okay, so it goes 10 to 2. So, so you could break it into be, shifts. Well, me would be about 1 to 2. That okay. okay, that's good. That's yeah. good. I unfortunately can't do it at all because I have to be at my job. I'm going to try all that day. Okay. Well, I mean, if there's not people at the table, then there will be materials on it and people can just right. grab it. The sign will be there, which exactly. gives recognition. And brochures will be there. People will just take them. Yeah. What, what hours is Ruth available to do it? If Michael can do one to two. Well, she's coming here in the morning right after Crestguard, she told me. Yeah. And not that I can speak for Ruth, but just with what she would be doing here, she might be able to do 10 to 11. Okay. okay. Well, that, I think that should be fine then. Yeah. yeah. Conversation. 
Okay. Okay. And then otherwise there'd be materials that people can just pick up. Yeah. Um, do we have anything else under other or? No, I have one other. Thing. Oh, you do. Okay. Yeah, I have passed out um, two brochures, well, a brochure and a booklet that I had gotten from um, an ADA training that I went to that was put on by the Mass Office on Disability. So, um, Tori, I believe these you can go online um, to uh, download. Um, I'm sorry, what is it? There, it's a disability rights laws in Massachusetts, and it, one's a booklet and the other is a brochure oh, that talks about them. Okay. But it was a really good workshop, um, and so there were um, ADA coordinators from all over the area. Wow, that was wow. Awesome. Oh, very, very interesting. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Now, see, they should have something like that. They should have a conference for commission, for the commission itself. And and, I, and and I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you, but we I have talked to um, when we were changing from committee on disabilities to commission on disability and talking to um, a couple people in the uh, Massachusetts Office on Disability. They were willing to come to one of our meetings, but I think because um, they're coming such a diff, different uh, distance, we would probably like them to be here for a good hour if not longer. Sure. And that's like one thing, but then, um, you know, putting something on that a whole bunch of commissioners can come to. Well, maybe this is something to look about okay. in, in September, because if we're going to invite East Stanton, Amherst, and Hadley, you can invite the commission to be here, let them talk from five to six, then we do a cookout. Mm -hmm. Well, when I had that um, workshop on accessibility, um, we had a lot of people from surrounding areas, including up in the Berkshires, that came down for for that. I think there, you were at that area. Yeah, but there was not very many city employees. No, there weren't a lot of city employees, but there were a number of other people. Mm -hmm. So you know, I think there's an interest, but having something that's you know bigger and bringing the office on disability here. Yeah. But do you agree that it would fit in in September if we had them come for an hour and have Well, it sounds like a, you know, it sounds to me like one, like a very good um, long range, everything on the plate plan. We'll see how it cooks down. Well, that's, you know what, in year. order to make it happen, you've got to be on them, you've got to book them immediately. Well, that's true. That's true. Immediately. Yeah, I mean, if we can book them. Oh, yes. You can't let it sit back. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is a, well, I think it's a quick one. Could we have other? Um, okay. I'm um, going to um, ask if in August, we have our meeting on August 19th. Um, I will not be here, and so I'm wondering if we can move it to August 12th, which would be the Tuesday before. Although, Mary, um, Councilor Barge, I think you might have something. I'm, I'm leaving it as it is. I'm here, I'm here, I'm not, I'm not. Okay. I feel if you're going on vacation, and maybe we need to start looking on what the laws are here, that it's not yeah. mandatory that you have to have these meetings. You only can, you by law, you can have six meetings a year. It's right in your booklet. Right. Your, uh, Councilor Barge found that. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just concerned because it's vacation time. You're going on vacation. Do we want to not have an August meeting? Right, because I think if we can get a hold of East Stanton, Amherst, and Hadley this month and book their commission to come here for September, we'd be all set. And I think that should be brought up in our June meeting, how we are doing notifying these sites. And also, Patty, you would be able to immediately get a hold of this group here to come in. Correct for September. Yeah, I, can make a I mean, they must have tons of people that they can send down here. 
because I know as a city councilor, whenever we have many things going on, you can't sit back. You gotta book them. And then we'll just have to probably communicate by email yeah. about um, the cookout, about who's gonna bring what. Would we be able to do that here? You gotta be careful with the email one because of the open meeting law. I mean, because it's like somebody's gonna bring um, <laughs> chips. Hot dog rolls. And they, <laughs> and they <laughs> don't. <laughs> Maybe you should explain it to them. Well, I, I understand about the whole meeting laws. Yeah. yeah, any of the emails that I send to you or you send to me don't have a public right. record. Right. So, right. say Patty sends it and it's got my name, Tori's name, and all that, don't reply back to all. You've broken the open meeting law. Right, yeah. No, I would. Gosh, I, would. I hope I've never done that. <laughs> No, I don't know. Just send it individually. Right. Right. I hope I've never done that inadvertently without knowing. <laughs> it's always something toward. But I won't do it ever again, I promise. All right. I don't I don't think I have. I tend to not do that. So So is somebody making a motion about not having a meeting in August? I'll make that motion. Oh, because we're not having a meeting in social services and veterans affairs in August either. People okay. want to be right, right. In, in August is typically. Okay, wait. So do we have we have a motion and a second? I second. Okay, yeah. second. Yeah. All in favor? Aye. 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 All opposed? Anybody want to meet in August? <laughs> okay. And Patty. Mm -hmm. So for our June meeting. Do you have the numbers of Hadley, Amherst, I do. and East Hampton? I have the whole and state. Who is yeah. the chair of these commissions? Yeah, I do. That's all listed on my website. Well, do you think possibly Thursday? I know it's the health fair. I'll be here. We could get on the phone and call these people. Um, I'm going to say that I can't guarantee that I have time to do that. Um, at the health and safety fair, because that's like an ongoing thing with yeah. all the exhibitors. Um, so I'm going to, I, I would say probably not on, on um, well, Thursday. Well, what your staff or your assistant making the call? To invite them for September? She could do that on Wednesday. I mean, tomorrow, right? So, yeah, tom actually, yeah, tomorrow. Well, it depends what time tomorrow, because um, we're moving all the tables and chairs and the furniture to set up for the health and safety fair. So, yeah. We so could, don't have anybody to make a phone call. Well, I, I do, but it depends what time. Like for, at 10 o'clock, probably 10 to 11.30, mm -hmm. and then there's some lunches, and then starting again at um, 1 o'clock to about 2.30, yeah. doing stuff. I'd like to see if you could copy that for me. Yep. Please. Because yep. okay. that way, Tori, we'll get on the calls and get these people booked. Right, for inviting them for our September meeting. Exactly. This is going to give them heads up and they can get back to us. And do, you have, do you have a list of the folks now? I have the complete list that I downloaded. Yeah. Everybody can get this, it's online. No, I know it is. And um, there's one have... Commission on Disability and ADA coordinators. Unfortunately, the lists are from July 2012. That's okay. It gives you a start. It gives, that, yeah. it gives you a starting point, and if someone's yep. not doing that anymore, then they'll say, "Oh, you actually need to call this person." Okay, yeah. Well, I just wondered if you had those ones um, uh, on their own. You know, the uh, Amherst Cavalry. Well, they're they're in alphabetical order of the. the yeah. Okay. Well, um, yeah. I mean, I Cavalry. I didn't get those. I just, Jeremy. Whoever, Chair Semke, Chairperson, Nine Stop Bridge Road, Hadley. At some point, Patty, when you're not busy, could you do just the commissions for me? I don't care about the other stuff. You can have that whole list. You can have it? Yeah, you can have it. I'll just download it again. Okay, so it's Hadley. And then Amherst. And it's going to be a round table, correct? 
that we're doing. Yeah, that'll be great. great. So we're going to have the first hour be yep. a meeting where we um, talk with them and talk about ways that we can affiliate and work together. And then after the first hour, we'll eat. Okay, I think that now. Great. Patty's going to handle that one. Thing. Yeah, I'll call them um, Boston to tomorrow. And our meeting starts at 5, so if we're going to have a meeting 5 to 6, and then what, uh, the cookout from 6 to 7. Yeah, is that right? That sounds... Okay, so, and we will listen to the folks home in Boston when... Are we going to have time to do both in that one meeting, or do we want What's to have that? around? We want to have. We talked about also having some people from Boston come in September. Yeah, let them come. They should be involved. So it'll be a round table. It won't be. It will be total. Okay, we'll do a total round table then. Yeah. Okay, so in September we're doing the round table with. Um, someone from Massachusetts Office on Disability, oh, excuse me, we're inviting Amherst, Hadley, East in, Hampton. In East Hampton. Um, and are you saying now we're not doing the cookout with this? Yes, we are doing yeah, we are. Okay. And that's what we're not doing what? We Sorry, are doing. you had said something about having the two things together. No, we are having the cookout at, at, after the meeting. Yeah, okay. Right. And so, Tori, you might want to appoint someone to be the... Um, Chair of the cookout committee. Anybody want to be in charge of the cookout? Okay, well, if you're saying no takers, you'll have to solicit. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we Make have some volunteers. Okay, yeah. can, we, can we bring? Can I? We put this on. Can we bring this up again at the June meeting when perhaps some people are here that weren't here tonight? Well, but that's great. Yeah, I think let's we do can. that. Yeah, I will. Do put it on uh, with. Right. This you know what? Meeting. I would suggest because the grilling is the biggest problem in finding yeah. people. That we just go cold food sandwiches yeah. or whatever. And like get out the grilling. Like maybe like some deli platters. We could get one yeah. Yeah, platter exactly. and right. one um, platter with meats. Like they have sure. them at Stop and Shop. Right. Yeah. Yeah, unless we found someone who really wants to grill. I and that could be a problem. I think that could definitely be a problem. I yeah. can't do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, neither can I. So I think that's that's what we so do. let's count out I think that's doing point. the grilling, and we can purchase the platters and we could get potato salad, macaroni right. salad. Right, and if people want to make stuff, that helps too. Yeah, if people want to make stuff, um, and we want to have some drinks, water and salsa. Right, and we need paper goods like napkins, plates, forks. And we can, yeah, let's bring, let's plan to bring this up again at the June meeting. Yeah. Thank you, Patty. Okay. Um, you know, I'm having a hard time finding any stamina in here, Patty. I got Easton. Easton. I know. So I'm totally okay, totally East Hampton. So totally and she totally actually was at that yeah. training. Huh? Oh, what? She's not on this paper. Yeah, yes. Here's the ADA for you. Yeah. Okay, Michael has made a motion to adjourn. So see, this one here is strictly commissions, culture. Do we have, you want to Do we have a second? Yeah, so some some Sorry. communities, like number three. Okay, so. we have a motion. And that's? That, uh, we have Michael motion to adjourn. Okay, who seconded it? Jim. Thank All you. in favor? Aye. Okay. Aye.